one, Hypatia of Alexandria, 360, 415 AD. Hypatia was a Greek mathematician and Neoplatonist philosopher in Roman Egypt. She made significant contributions to mathematics and astronomy, while also teaching and promoting intellectual pursuits at a time when women had limited access to education. She is often celebrated as one of the most prominent female scholars and intellectuals of her time. Hypatia received a comprehensive education from her father, Theon of Alexandria, in various fields, including mathematics, astronomy, and philosophy. As a prominent Neoplatonist philosopher, she merged her philosophical beliefs with her mathematical and scientific studies, pioneering a holistic approach to understanding the universe. Today, she is celebrated for her contributions to mathematics, where she edited and refined mathematical works of earlier scholars and authored her own treatises on algebra, number theory, and geometry. Her teaching career in Alexandria was groundbreaking as she defied societal norms by educating both male and female students. Tragically, Hypatia's life ended in violence due to political and religious tensions in Alexandria. Her pagan beliefs and association with Governor Orestes made her a target. In 415 AD, she was brutally murdered by a Christian mob, marking a dark chapter in Alexandria's history. 2. Boudicca, 25-60 AD. Boudicca, also spelled Boadicea, was a Celtic queen of the Aseni tribe in ancient Britain during the first century AD. She is remembered as a courageous and fierce warrior who led a major uprising against Roman rule in 60-61 AD. After the death of her husband, King Prasutagus, the Romans seized control of the Iseni lands, subjected Boudicca to mistreatment, and violated the rights of the tribe. In response, Boudicca rallied her people and neighboring tribes, amassing a substantial army. Her forces launched devastating attacks on Roman settlements, notably sacking the cities of Colchester, London, then Londinium, and Verulamium, modern-day St. Albans. Boudicca's leadership and her people's thirst for vengeance against Roman oppression resulted in a series of victories. However, her rebellion eventually faced a decisive defeat by the Roman governor Suetonius Paulinus, likely in the West Midlands. Boudicca either died in battle or by suicide to avoid capture. But her legacy as a symbol of British resistance against foreign oppression lives on. 3. Gupta, Empress Kumaradevi, 4th century AD. Empress Kumaradevi was a prominent figure during the Gupta Empire, which thrived in ancient India from around the 4th to 6th centuries AD. She played a crucial role in supporting and promoting art, culture, and education during a golden era in Indian history. Kumaradevi was the wife of Emperor Chandragupta II one of the most celebrated Gupta rulers. Her reign coincided with a period of remarkable achievements in various fields, including literature, science, and art. She is particularly associated with the famous Udayagiri Caves, which are a group of rock-cut cave temples in central India. These caves feature stunning sculptures and inscriptions many of which pay tribute to Kumaradevi and her contributions. It's believed that she played a significant role in their creation and patronage. Kumaradevi's support for education and the arts helped foster an environment of cultural flourishing in the Gupta Empire, and her legacy endures through the artistic and architectural marvels of her time. While her husband is often celebrated for his military conquests and political achievements, Kumara Devi's contributions to the cultural and intellectual life of the Gupta Empire are equally noteworthy.